Good morning, collectives, and welcome back to Will's Cartomancy Tarot. If you're new to my channel, I certainly appreciate both your viewership as well as your subscription. Okay, so what I like to do, ladies and gentlemen, is to do a more special topics type discussion here. We've all seen, you know, what's been going on with Bill Cosby lately, and we do realize that he's been subjected to prolonged sexual allegations, okay? And his legal debacle, actually he has to go back to court again today here um, because an alternate juror is, has been assigned to his case. So basically what I like to do in this reading is to see whether this alternate juror will make or break the case or just simply will Bill Cosby win his case, okay? So today what I like to do is to go on and just get out my guilted reverie, the enormous cards, to help address this issue, okay? And of course, you know he's back in court today because he's, you know, been accused of molesting Judy Hoff at the Playboy Mansion here, okay? And the case is starting up again today here, ladies and gentlemen, so make sure that you're watching it. So I'm going to go on and just shuffle up here just to see what the cards have to say in terms of whether Bill Cosby is going to defeat this case or not here. I want to first start off by just doing a yes or no question first, and then I'm going to give you more specifics uh, in terms of what I'm seeing here. Okay, so Spirit, I ask that you guide me to the correct cards to help identify whether Bill Cosby is going to win or whether he's going to go return back to jail. Okay, let's see here. All right, let's see what we have. And I'm going to go on and just pull up 13 cards first. Okay. And there's an important card that is to appear. If the ring card, card 25, appears in this reading, then my answer is yes. Let's see. We have... Wow, that's the first card, ladies and gentlemen. So that already gives a resounding yes. He is certainly going to win his case here that I'm getting. Okay, so let's see what the reason why here. Okay, I'm going to go on and just turn over a few more cards. We have um, the ring here. Okay, we also have the key. Okay, we have, wow. Wow. We have card 28 here. So let's look at these cards first to kind of get a message here to see why he's going to win here. I kind of feel that, you know, of course, when you're with this card here, this card is a very successful card. It's all about happiness, ladies and gentlemen. It's all about harmony, a very auspicious turn of events, a very good outcome. Okay. And then you're connecting this with this key card here that certainly shows a successful solution, a resolution to a problem that may have been plaguing, okay? And it also shows quite plausibly that some type of an arrangement or agreement might be made here. I really don't see Bill Cosby returning to jail um, with looking at these cards here. And then you have this man connected, okay? So this man, you know, it could be the alternate juror, it could be Bill Cosby or it could be someone on his team, you know, who will, in fact, provide additional information or they're going to be crucial to this case here because he's shown here. OK. I feel that this person certainly is going to help prove Bill Cosby innocence. Like I said, it could potentially be his legal team or it could be someone uh, on the jury or on the panel, you know, in the jury. All right. But it certainly shows here that I feel that he's going to be very successful. Let's go on and just look at the bottom cards here and see what other information, ladies and gentlemen, that I could uh, glean for you guys here with this. So we have the moon, which is also a very good card. All of his cards are showing up very positive because with the moon, that's also a very auspicious turn of events. And it shows you know, that his legal team will be very persuasive and the judge is going to believe it. And I think that it, they're going to make a very compelling 
you know, type argument here. And also when you have the moon card, this is also connected with a famous person as well here, you know, and it could be a famous lawyer or somebody that kind of comes into the play that is going to really help. Okay. I'm curious to see how everything works out with this. All right. And then you have a woman. So this woman is also, she's going to be connected. So it looked like a woman as well as a man appears to somehow be significant. But what I'm seeing here, because we have 19, this is a card that's showing that they're going to be in court somehow. Okay. And that this woman here is looking to the past. So it could be Miss Huff or it could be any of the other women, you know, that he's been having these debacles with. You know, I feel as a tall woman that I'm getting here. But a tall woman gets very uh, promiscuous here. So it kind of raises suspicious as to whether, you know, this woman is lying on him. I'm not saying that he didn't do these things, but the, these are some very promiscuous type cards here that lend themselves. And these cards lend themselves to these type of behaviors happening. And it's more of a consensual nature here that I'm kind of getting with those two cards. And lo and behold, ladies and gentlemen, guess what follows that card? The fox. So what is the fox? It's all about trickery. It's all about lies. It's all about deception. And since this card is more so closely, ladies and gentlemen, connected here with this woman, it seems to be more that she's kind of, you know, telling a fib. It's a tall woman I'm getting here. Okay, that's telling a fit. She has reddish or light hair that I'm getting. Okay. They're, I'm seeing both a tall as well as a short woman that's kind of showing up here. But they both seem to be very promiscuous. So I'm not sure whether, you know, Bill Cosby is fully responsible of everything they're blaming him for. But you know what we're going to do? I'm going to take out my magic bag here. <laughs> And see, could we see who actually is lying in this case? So what we're going to do, ladies and gentlemen, if Bill Cosby name shows up in these letters, it means he's lying. If any of those women names show up in these uh, letters, then it means that they're lying. Both of their names may show up in it, but it just seems that at the end, Bill Cosby certainly is going to be absolved of these um, allegations here. Whether they be true or not, I'm just kind of seeing a very successful outcome for him. So, Spirit, I ask that you got me to the 20 letters to help identify clearly who's lying in this matter. Is it Bill Cosby? Is it um, Miss Huff? Or any of the other women who are involved in this case that we're going to be seeing there with him, okay? 20 letter spirit, 20 letters, 20 letters. Let's see, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 13, 7 more letters and I'm going to call them off to you ladies and gentlemen. One, two, three, four, five. All right, let's see what we have. We have a Y, okay? We have an E, an A, an N, a J. And if you guys see other names are in here that appears here, you can help me identify them we're we're looking basically for Bill Cosby and these females who are, you know, kind of taking him to court. But it could be other names that show here too that also have accused him. We have an L H D A A R U O E We have an 
another E. We have another E. G. M. B. And we have an I, okay? So let's look at the letters here that I'm getting. I'm looking here, okay? We have, let's see, we have a J, right? Okay. Mm. We have also a U, ladies and gentlemen. Guess what, ladies and gentlemen? We also have a D, okay? And guess what? We have a Y also. Who does this name spell? Judy, right? So it seems that she's lying in here. I mean, I'm looking at these other letters here. We only have a B. We have an I. And we just have one L. So it's quite plausible that Bill could be, but it didn't fully spell out his name here. However, since actually it did because his it spelled his, um, his, his middle name, Henry. H E N R Y. I think they're both lying, ladies and gentlemen, but I think Bill Cosby is going to get off. But I think that this has been set up and done. I think it's most of the reason why this is being done, it seems to be because of money I'm getting. You know, this is just so crazy here. I just hope that this, you know, ends successfully. And, you know, everybody just, you know, it, you know, the judge really or the jurors really reach a, a, a fair conclusion here. So, guys, tell me what you think in regards to this matter. OK, thank you so much for viewing this reading. Um, again, if you liked it, please be sure to like and share and just send me over your comments because I am very interested in hearing what will occur in this matter. OK. Thanks a lot and enjoy your day.